Hey, Bleeders! Welcome to a new unboxing video. You're used to this by now. I don't have to go through the motions. I will say one thing, though. It's very positive. Um, you'll notice that I have better lighting now. Hey, you can see my face. For better or for worse. It's probably for worse. Because I'm not very pretty. Or am I? Am I pretty? Tell me I'm pretty. Tell me I'm pretty. I'm so beautiful. <laughs> Alright, so enough of that. So, of course, unboxing. Um, you know what to expect. It's Dino Drag. So, here we are. Dinosaur Dracula. Matt, you never let me down. So let's see what he's got in store for us this month. Get our trusty exacto knife here and try not to cut my fingers off. Do -do 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 -do. It's so. Oh, wait, there's more tape. Shit, I'm stupid. <laughs> I'm a moron. I'm the moroniest moron of all. Here we go. Ooh, all right, right away we have a really nice Dino Drag sticker. Well, I want a nice little star. Yeah. I will be trying to salvage those as best I can. <laughs> and then we have, ooh, more tissue paper. This time, it's black. Oh, it, sm it smells kind of minty, too. Yeah. It's got some minty, minty. Oh, there's more of it. Oh, oh I just rub it all over myself. Oh, it's so minty. I'm ridiculous, aren't I? Oh, well. Alright, get that back. Alright, inside we have... Ooh, this might be why it smells kind of minty-ish. It's like uh, atomic fireballs. We got, we got some atomic fireballs in here. Oh yeah, it's definitely what it smells like. It's, it's, it's cinnamon. It's not mint, it's cinnamon. Yeah, it's cinnamon. Oh man, atomic fireballs. This brings me back. It's sort of candy that uh, most kids didn't want to eat. That dare to eat shit like this. And then now there's kids who will actually eat this shit on purpose without being dared. And I don't know what's wrong with them. But hey, I'm probably gonna eat it on purpose because nostalgia. <laughs> I'm all about that nostalgia. All right, what else we got in here? We got, we got a little, we got a little, 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 little thing. Little, little, I don't, I don't know. Um, I suppose I should, I should open it. I mean, it seems like a reasonable thing to do. You can just throw it this way now. And it's it's Alf! It's Alf! Hey motherfuckers, it's Alf! What you bitches up in here doing? Where's the kitty? Give me the kitty! I can't do an Alf impression. I have no I can't do it. I can't. I just sound like Phil Hartman trying to do Sean Connery or something. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, Elf. That's pretty cool. That's definitely welcome addition to my collection of strange artifacts and nostalgic, beautiful things. It will join the mass around me. All-encompassing mass. Look, look at the mass. All-encompassing mass of things. All of the things. It will be one. All right, let's, let's fix that. That was ridiculous. All right, uh, we're going to sit him there next to the atomic fireballs. Here, we're going to fix the camera a little more because this camera does not want to cooperate. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I, I probably shouldn't have picked it up. Hmm. Next up, this is cool. Dino Drag specimen number eight. 
And this one comes in a open openable bag instead of it being stuck shut like some of the other specimens. The Rocketeer candy. All right, all right. This is important, so I'm going to get up for a second. This is fucking important. Wait, you, you fuckers, wait. I, I didn't mean to call you guys fuckers. I love you. I love you. Do not, please, please, please keep watching my video. Please don't leave me. I need you. No, sorry. Right. So, so, I'm a huge fan of the Rocketeer. I have Rocketeer comics. I have the Rocketeer Blu-ray. I'm a massive fan. Massive. Uh, so, to get this as a specimen this month, fucking amazing. And I don't normally open specimens, mostly because they're in those nice little bags that you can't really open, because uh, or don't want to open, regardless. Um, this time, I'm actually going to take a peek inside of it. Uh, don't eat it. It's from 1991. Oh my god. You're really bringing me back here, Matt. The Rocketeer is a movie about a 1930s superhero who wore a really cool helmet. It starred Paul Serino. No, he did not play the titular character. He didn't. The guy who actually did star in it, um, what was his name? I can never remember his name. What is your name, sir? I can't find his name. What is his name? His name's got to be on here somewhere. No, his name's not on here. What the hell? He's the star of the movie, and he's he's just like, oh, no, let's not put his name on the movie. It was uh, uh, Bill Campbell? I think it's his name. Bill Campbell? Yeah. Bill, Bill Campbell? You're fucking awesome. I, I loved you as the Rocketeer, man. You were great as Cliff. Look at you. You're beautiful. It's a handsome man. Look, ah, it's a glare. It's a glare. Ah, the glare. Ah, all right. Look at him. He's so handsome. He's so handsome. Focus. Focus. No. All right. We're going to open this up and take a look at the candy dispenser because if I remember correctly, there were actually multiple candy dispensers. Um, there were lots of Rocketeer products back then, but, you know, product placement was a thing back then. So we just open this bitch up and oh, look at it. It's so beautiful. So beautiful. Look at this baby. Look at this baby. Oh my god. And it's still sealed. It's still got the little plastic wrap around it. It's just candy, candy, net weight 0 0.15 ounces. Holy crap, it's so little and old. I love it. Um, I'm going to debate with myself whether I want to put this on the shelf. I as is, or do I want to put it back in this baggie so it's safe? For now, I'm just going to put it back in this baggie. Yeah. So no one can touch it. It's for me, not for you. You can't touch it. It's mine. Get it. No, it's mine. Get out of here. Get out of here. Alright, we're going back to the box. Next up in the box, we got, oh, all right, you remember the Holiday Warriors, right? They were pretty cool. They were pretty cool. And he's done it again. It's Donald Drax, Roarbots. Yeah, he's taking some little cheap, uh, cheap little, little toys there and throwing them in there. I love this. My stars, Dino Drax seeks to expand his empire. He commands his robot army to board their shuttles and find new worlds for him to conquer. His Roarbots are harbingers of doom for any alien world unfortunate enough to be visited. Package includes one Roarbot and one Roarbot ship, nothing else. Also, I would like to point out that it actually doesn't say Harbingers for all of you grammar Nazis out there, which I am one. Uh, it actually does say Harbringers. <laughs> so, please don't correct me. <laughs> I know it's inaccurate. I know it's not right. Alright, um, next up we got Elf Cards! Elf Cards! Alright, we got, we got an Elf and Elf Cards. It's, it's beautiful. We got, we got Elf, we got Elf Cards. <sighs> I should mention this theme this month is is uh, sci-fi. It's like aliens and stuff. So so of course this is all like the, the cool stuff you get here. All right, what else we got in here? 
Gonna move on. It's the sticker that's inside the box. It's the sticker that's inside the box. So I, I don't have to, to peel it off inside the box I got here. Or I can peel off the one inside the box and have this one as an extra. I can have two stickers. Oh, man, you're awesome. All right, we got, we got, um, I think this is like a total uh, trend he's doing here. He just keeps, he just keeps sticking these lovely little Donkey Kong cards in there. Look, it's more Donkey Kong sticker cards. Jump man at work and stop Donkey Kong. Is that back from when uh, Mario wasn't actually called Mario? He was just called Jumpman? <laughs> Imagine if that stuck around. Jumpman 64! <laughs> we got some more trading cards in here, because Matt's awesome like that. We got Star Trek The Next Generation. Because, yeah, I mean, why not? Why the fuck not? Star Trek? Come on. Star Trek? God, don't you know how this works? It's Star Trek. Normally I would open these up right now and look at them, but I don't want to keep making these videos too long, so we're going to step that down for now and I'll look at it later. Um, we got Starship Troopers trading cards. I love this movie. All right. I know a lot of purists who um, love the book and hate the movie. And there's a lot of people that hate the book and uh, hate the book because they say it's boring, and they love the movie. I don't hate either. I think the book's good. I think the movie's good. Fucking shit. So what the hell? I mean, I, I love the movie. I love gory, like horror movie stuff, and I love sci-fi, and I, I like I kind of like military movies to a certain extent. I mean, you know, mm, you don't want to trail too weird into the military stuff. I, I don't know. I'm not gonna get into it. We're gonna newsletter for this month. We're going to take a peek inside the newsletter. Oh, man, the newsletter is like multiple pages. You can fill it. It's got a thickness to it. Oh, look, it has, it has Xenomorph. It has Xenomorph. Oh. Oh, we, we got man, we got, a, we got a pop-up on the computer. It's pissing me off. Fucking telling me that I need to install an update for Java. Don't you tell me what to do, Windows. Don't you tell me. I will do what I want to do. You are not the boss of me. All right, all right. We we, we cool. We cool. Don't make me smack you. I will smack the shit out of you. All right, we got we got this in this. Of course, this is great. It is always great. Signed by Matt. Always signed by Matt. I'm gonna get a booklet with some little clear pages and put all the, the newsletters in it. So we got some space games and trivia stuff. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I'm going to read it in full later because I want to finish this video for you guys. So we're going to we're going to set this lovely newsletter over here. Oh, over, over over here. Over there. It's this this is going over here. All right. Uh, letting people see my big beefy arms. You like that? Yeah. All right. What else we got in here? We got uh, we got these stamps. I think these stamps. It's Fifty fish. It's all stuck together there. Fifty fish includes whale. Huh. it's stamps. Stamps. It's fish stamps. Fifth. 50 fish stamps and one whale. One whale. Somewhere inside this package is this package of stamps. Is a whale. I wonder if it's a blue whale. I like the blue whales. You know why? Because they have a funny name. Beluga. Say it with me. Beluga. I'm fucking stupid. All right. Putting these aside, with all of the other things that I've set aside, we have, of course, the beautiful work of art. We always get a beautiful work of art. We got another beautiful. Donald Drack, March 2015. We got a beautiful mini poster. I am on some planet somewhere. Yes, you are, Donald Drack. Yes, you are. You are indeed on some planet somewhere. I'm not sure what planet. 
Well, all I know is you better watch out for this guy right here. This guy right here looks kind of foreboding. Look at him. I don't trust him. I don't trust him one bit. He's, he's got fangs. Uh, you got fangs too, but he's got fangs too. And I don't like him. He's, he's scary. Stay away from him. Don't, 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 don't. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so. Is the box empty? Is it empty? It looks empty. Except I put something aside. Normally I save, um. I do save usually the specimen for last. But. There was something extremely cool inside this box, and I wanted to save it for last. Uh, I feel like Matt would approve of that. This is a seriously cool thing. All right. There was this little company called THK. All right. They were like a uh, division of Palisades Toys. Now, Palisades Toys had the rights to aliens for a short time. You know, you know, you know, aliens like the xenomorphs. All right. So they made these little figures and stuff, and they made these little little figures, little, little like, like 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 this big, like like uh, the Green Army Men, but they're not because they're like Space Marines or not, they're Colony Marines, they're Colony Marines and Xenomorphs fighting. And bad. And he included a, a set, a two pack of them, and it's here, it's here. Look at it, it's beautiful. It's it's like he's like a Green Army Man, but he's he's not. He's a Colony Marine, and it's it's not green, but it's like a transparent blue. Xenomorph, I don't know where you can see it. I, I might have to open the package. I might have to, I might have to open the package. I don't know. Then get the package open. I, I'm terrible at this. I don't want to destroy the box. I... Technical difficulties here! Ah. I always suck it up in these little boxes. Alright. Alright, I got it. I got it. I got it. I'm right. just going to slide this bitch out. Get it, we slide it out so you can see. So look at him. Look at him. He's so pretty. He's so pretty. Look at him. Look. Look. He's the little little alien. He's a little little blue. And he's a little little man. Little man and a little little alien. It's a little alien. He's gonna eat your face. He's not gonna hug your face. He's not a face hugger. He's an animal. He's like a warrior soldier or whatever. Like ant terminology. All right. I'm gonna put this back in the box. Because I think I'm just going to keep that in the box. Because the box is a nice little display piece. Yeah. Yeah. And these would be hell to dust off. I have lots of little figures that are already hell to dust off. I don't freaking freaking. I, I need to dust more. I don't dust nearly enough. My room is covered in fucking dust. It's everywhere. It's kicked. I feel them crawling on my skin. Ow. Oh. God, they're moving, they're moving. All right, I'm, yeah, I, I said before I'm stupid. So, yeah, done a direct fun pack verdict this month. Fucking awesome. It's always awesome. I have not seen a bad one yet. Still, by far, my favorite subscription service. By far. It's better than all of them. Better than Luke Ray, better than Nerd Black, it's better... Better than Netflix. Fuck Netflix. Who gives Netflix? Dino Trek. Who you want to give your money? You want to give your money? You want to give your money? Stupid fucking like, subscription services. Give it to Dino Trek. Give your money to Matt. Because he knows what's up. I'll come over there if you don't. I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hurt you or anything, because that would be illegal. I don't want to go to jail. But you know, I might, I might give you like an uncomfortable, a really uncomfortably long hug. Yeah. Although some of you might like that. You, know, you want a hug? I'll give you a hug. Just, just a nice, nice tight, nice tight hug. Look deeply in my eyes. You, you want a hug? I'll give you a hug. Let's get hot. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. I train to Mondovina. I train to the end.
running hard and running fast To meet my future and away from my past Taking the gamble that cannot last Night train to the end Hell's ride to Mundo Fine Hell's ride to the end 